Hey Cancer and welcome to my channel. This is for Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus for the week of the 9th through the 16th. So I'm going to go ahead and tip you on down here and we will get started. Spirit Angels, what messages do you have for Cancer? Ooh, I'm going to put those all back. What messages do you have for Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus for July 9th through the or 16th. Okay, let's see what we got here. The Four of Cups, the Two of Swords, the Seven of Cups in reverse, Strength. And the Knight of Cups. And who is Cancer dealing with? For the person you're thinking about um, in a relationship, in separation, however it resides with you, they have the Four of Swords, the Four of Pentacles, the Ace of Wands, the Queen of Swords in reverse. And the Nine of Wands. And what's the outcome? Okay, your bottom of the deck. Somebody's coming back from the past. Um, the universe is putting somebody back into your path. Um for a um, re a reconciliation or um, if your karmic lessons were not learned, they will be returning. Um, let me get some clarifiers out for you guys, Cancer, and we'll get started. Why is the Four of Cups here? So for this week, you guys, you have the Four of Cups clarified by the Three of Pentacles. So um, some of you are staying where you're at because it's stable. Um, this is has to do with work for some of you. Um, even though there's other opportunities that are better out there for you, um, you're staying where you know that you are safe, where it's stable, where you can um, have recognition at work. For those of you um, that this is dealing with love, you um, are part of a third party and you are thinking about somebody else. You're bored where you're at, but you're staying there because you're financially secure. You're financially stable. Um, even though you could have success and you know you could with this other person, you are um, being faced with a decision this week. You have the choice between two people, two situations. Um, and this is being brought on by a fire sign. Um, this fire sign is acting out of haste, though. They're acting immaturely. Um, they're not thinking before they speak. Um, this is really causing you to uh, consider moving forward. You are coming out of a time of confusion. Um, you th you were thinking something was real that it wasn't. Um, uh, this person was just interested in a one-night stand or a very... Uh, non-committal relationship and it's the same as this person over here um so you're trying to decipher what this relationship is whether it's real whether it's love whether it's lust um and and that's the choice you're being faced with you are um going to be taking control of the situation um you are going to continue to work on yourself work on, um, the situation and, and it's calling for you to be patient because this person is coming in to offer you love. Um, and once again, it's clarified by the strength card, most definitely could be a Leo, but this person is coming in to, to offer you love. So at the beginning of the week, you're very, um, just blah, you know, the universe is offering you something right here. You're not seeing exactly what it is, um, but by the end of the week, they are coming forward. So just be patient. Um, be patient, and they will be coming for you very shortly. Um, it's calling for you to be patient because they're in a time of rest right now. They're taking a step back and 
um, deciding what it is that they also want. Um, they could be with somebody else. You are the third person in this party. Look at their three of wands and the empress. Most definitely you are the third person in this party. This person is taking the time to rest though. Um, with three, you have th the empress is three and the three of wands. This person is moving forward towards you. This person is choosing you. They are coming. Um, their blessings or your blessings are moving forward you're waiting for your ships to come in and they're coming and uh, you guys are going to be moving. If you're at a distance from each other, you guys are going to be moving closer to each other as well. But at the beginning of the week, they're going to realize that they want to start something new with you. They want to start something. Um, they want to create a beautiful relationship with you right now. They've been holding back. They've been holding on to their emotions. They've been um, holding back from investing in this relationship because they were scared of what the outcome was. And then there's the King of Wands. Oh, I'm sorry. The King of Cups was up here. Um, this, you have a choice to make between somewhere where you're no longer satisfied and some, another fire sign. Um, but the King of Wands, this is the fire sign. So this person that you are, um, waiting on is a fire sign. They are coming towards you very quickly. Um, and they will be offering you their love. But they've been holding on to their emotions and investing in you until they um, until they knew exactly what it was they want. And what they want is a passionate new beginning with you. This is somebody from your past. You have been with this person before. Yeah, in the Ace of Pentacles. Once you see, once they figure this out, they're going to come forward with a very, very amazing offer. Um and it's just going to be a new beginning. It's going to open so many doors for you that um, that you didn't even know existed within this relationship. And it's going to come in very fast. They are getting out of a situation that they are no longer fulfilled by. They are leaving somebody um, that was in this third party as well. Um, they could be overindulging and trying to deal with this situation. Not necessarily. For me, this is... Um, they're getting up the courage to leave this person and making their own dreams come true, making their own wishes come true, grabbing life by the horns and going with it. Um, they are tired of battling this person. Um, they are breaking free of, oops, they are breaking free of this codependency that they have on each other and they are manifesting a relationship with you. So stay strong and be patient. This is coming this week for this group of you. They are going to come forward and offer you something. They are letting you know they're walking away from somebody else and they want to offer you a new beginning, a new life, a fresh start. This is going to answer all your prayers. You've been praying to the universe, to the heavens um, for this um, to come to fruition and it's coming for you. Your, your prayers and your dreams, your prayers are being answered. Yeah. Yeah. You were worried they weren't going to move forward with you. You were worried they weren't coming back. You were worried they were not going to find the spiritual um, side of your connection. And they are. They are moving forward. With the next moon phase of the moon, um, they will be moving forward. Secrets had to come out with their partner as well. They have the Queen of Wands here. So secrets are coming out um, about... Secrets are coming out to their partner. They are with somebody else at the moment. They are breaking free from them to be with you, however. So this person is going to find out these secrets that they've been hiding about your relationship. And uh, the Knight of Wands in reverse is here because they want a new beginning with you. They don't want a quick relationship. They don't want to be in and out of your life. They want to offer you something new and and real. This is true love with the Ace of Cups here. You are getting a new start by the end of the week, Cancer. How amazingly beautiful. Um, this is your soulmate. This is your twin flame. And look at that. A new beginning. A new beginning with the Queen of Wands. You guys have the Fool. Um, fresh start. Wiping, whoa, wiping the slate clean. Moving forward and having faith in your journey. Taking that leap of faith um, with this person. Um, and it's going to be so worth it. This new beginning coming for you is going to be an absolutely amazing, um, 
amazing relationship with this soulmate twin flame vibe. What advice do you have for cancer? All right, deception. So um, the person that you're dealing with, cancer, they are hiding this from their partner. They are wearing a false mask in the relationship, but go ahead and express your love to them because um, once you make this romantic gesture, they're going to get the courage to leave. Um, yeah, and heart-to-heart -heart conversations. Once they know how you truly feel, once you know how they tr that you truly want to make this relationship work with them, that you want to be together, um, they're going to let this mask fall off. They're going to come out and be truthful and honest with their other partner, and they will then move forward to you, Cancer. So you guys have an exciting week ahead. Your twin flame, your soulmates are coming back, your uh, life partners, whoever this person is to you, it is somebody that you will be with for the long, the long haul. So in this lifetime. So I hope you guys enjoyed your weekly love reading. Um, you guys have big changes this week, but all for the better, all for the good. So as always, I send you love, light, and God bless, and I'll see you next time.